In this video, we are going to uh, rewrite linear equations into slope-intercept form. And this is within the Delta Math online system, their assignment called standard to slope-intercept form. So we're given the equation 2y minus 2x equals negative 14. So let's remember, slope-intercept form is y equals mx plus b, where we know m is the slope value and b is the y-intercept. So you just got to remember, just got to get y equals, all right? So we want to look at this equation. What do we want to move? We want to move that 2x. So negative 2x, I'm going to add 2x to both sides of the equation. So then I get 2y equals, well, negative 2x plus 2x becomes 0 on the left side of the equal sign. And the right side, remember, combine like terms. So it's like really there's 0x here, right? 0x minus 14. So 0x plus 2x is 2x, and then minus 14. All right, we're almost there. Not quite, though, right? So we need it to be 1y, not 2y. So we are going to divide both sides of the equation by 2. And remember, you divide every term by 2. All right, so we're going to get y equals 1x minus 7. So that is slope-intercept form. So let's put it into our equation here for delta math, y equals x minus 7. Since it's 1, I don't have to put a 1 in front of the x of the coefficient. If you don't see a number there, we know it's 1. And we'll submit our answer, and there we go. Let's do another one. This time we have 6y minus 3x equals 30. So I'm going to add 3x to both sides. All right, so now we have 6y equals 3x plus 30. Now we're going to divide both sides by 6 because we want 1y. One All right, so then we get y, because 6 over 6 becomes 1. 1y one equals, now 3 over 6x, which is going to be 1 half x. And then 30 divided by 6 is 5, so plus five. So let's type it into Desmos. I'm sorry, Delta Math, not Desmos. And we get y equals one over two x plus five. There you go. And that's all there is to it. 